Later on, we'll check in with Jody and see what she's doing inside. She's got a big project going on. Jody has been doing a lot of redecorating in the RV lately. But one thing that she has been thinking about for quite some time now is repainting the cabinets in the kitchen and dinette area. So with all of our camping reservations having been canceled due to COVID-19, we thought this was the best time to take on this big project. We disassembled all the cabinetry in the kitchen first, including removing the microwave oven and all of the metal hardware which Jody painted an oiled bronze. Then Jody got to painting. It took about three or four coats to completely cover the cabinets, but uh, we got it all done in a day. And by we, I mean mostly Jody got it all done. When it came to removing the frog tape, it carefully ran a razor blade along the edge first, just to make sure the paint didn't stick to the tape and then peel away when I was taking them off. Next day, Jody reassembled all the cabinetry and the kitchen was done. Then she started on the dinette area. However, after painting around the fridge, we took a break and contemplated stopping there. But Jody wanted to finish the whole job, so we started on the rest of the cabinets over the dinette and even the map cupboard by the door.
took two full weekends to complete the job, but the difference was amazing. It was so much brighter in there. Having completed the repainting, Jody then decided that the floor needed redone. So we got some self-stick vinyl flooring from uh, Amazon. I'll, I'll put the link in the description. And got to work laying down some new flooring in the kitchen and the hall. For the sections that had odd cuts, we first made a template out of just uh, some lined paper, then transferred that to the vinyl with a pencil. cut it out and put it in place and it fit perfectly. At the spot where the floor butted up against the carpeting, we would cut the pieces slightly oversized by about maybe a quarter of an inch and then tuck them under the carpet so it was a nice tight fit. Between the cabinets being all repainted with the hardware all in the wood bronze and the new gray floor, it made a big difference. All in all, it only took one weekend of work to complete the floor. So between the cabinets and the floor, it was less than a month's work and just on the weekends. Thanks for watching. Be sure to check out some of our other videos with other DIY projects and even travel videos and reviews. And please subscribe if you want to see more DIY stuff like this.